Hello everyone, uh, Lee J two five one two here. Uh, this is going to be a bit of a weird video. Um, I've decided to do a thing for a YouTube channel for the Wizarding World uh, YouTube channel. So that's where fans get together. They ask people to submit videos of their collections or anything else Harry Potter related. And I've wanted to do it for a long time, and I've wanted to show off my collection for a long, long time. But there's so much stuff that I thought I would just uh, take my time and decide what I want to do with it. So I've decided to do them in kind of three parts in one video obviously so uh, this is pretty much everything noble collection I have uh, yeah. it's a lot of stuff over amassed this stuff has been amassed over maybe eight years or something uh, let's just pan it around so starting from the left hang on there's another thing here boom, boom, boom. there we have the Hogwarts house's bookmarks uh, going left to right we have the Ravenclaw diadem that was a gift for Christmas last year. People who know my channel will remember that. The uh, Deathly Hallows pendant from Xenophilius Lovegood. A Hufflepuff house pen. The Golden Egg from Goblet of Fire. That was from the... Uh, that was for Christmas as well, along with the diadem. The Time Turner in front of that, which is very, very nice. The Umbridge Quill. Um, I wish I could show like everything specifically, but there's just not a lot of time because I've got a lot to get through. <laughs> Uh, the Philosopher's Stone next to the Golden Egg. In front of that we have the Felix Felicis uh, little pendant, the vial, that's the word I was looking for. The next to that there is the um, locket from the cave. Wow, that, that was like one of the first things I got from Noble Collection. Then moving a bit right we have Tom Riddle's diary over that way. So that's, uh, that's like a blank journal, it's really awesome. Then we have Dumbledore's knife that he uses in the Half-Blood Prince. Um, we have uh, Gringotts coins, which are just beautiful. Doing this video actually gave me the opportunity to dust some of these things because it's been a while since I've really looked at them. And then we have the Hufflepuff cup on the right there. And then uh, we've got the, the Deluminator, Ron's Deluminator over here. Uh, well, so we've got the Prophecy from Order of the Phoenix, the one that gets smashed. Spoilers. Uh, we've got Harry Potter's glasses themselves. That's pretty cool. Uh, try and get zoom in. We've got a Hungarian horn tail right here. That's these. This is really cool. This is like a little um, statue thing that I got a long time ago, probably because it's my favorite um, dragon from Goblet of Fire. Uh, then we have the Horcrux ring that Dumbledore has. I'll move this around, hang on a second. And then we can focus a little bit. Uh, yeah, this is the ring that Dumbledore uses. And, yep, from the Half-Blood Prince. And behind that we have the broomstick um, bookmarks. They were bookmarks as well. They are very, very nice. And next to that we have the... Um, uh, Horcrux, the Slytherin Locket, and also this thing here that people, that this is my recent video, uh, this is Newt Scamander's journal, this is also um, Noble Collection, so all of this stuff, oh and the, that thing in the back over there in the distance that's covered up is the Mirror of Erised, I covered it up because the reflection was annoying me, so in the video, so it was a bit of a nightmare, but yeah, uh, all of this is Noble Collection stuff that I've gotten uh, probably over the past few eight, nine years, and I am very proud of my collection. It's, um, YouTube has helped me get a lot of this, uh, because I've been on the channel for quite a long time now. And I do regular kind of unboxings for things if I can and reviews and stuff. So I really, really love a lot of this stuff, especially some of the things that I've got sentimental, sentimental, uh, uses from, well, feelings for me, like the diadem and the egg Christmas presents from my friend, a lot of things were bought for as you know Christmas presents for me, and so I can't imagine ever selling them. And I'm like really proud of all of them. It took a long time to organise in this little state here. Oh, I forgot to mention this as well. This is the uh, Mad Eye Moody flask, and I'll lift it up a little bit. I missed that. It's good because the camera picks this up as a face. <laughs> so uh, this is very cool, and it opens and closes. I really wish I had time to kind of, yeah. Uh, show off everything I could. Please don't fall down, please don't fall down. There we go. 